Oh, goody. Two birds, one stone. This is gonna hurt, boys. Line up. I'm gonna start with Stiggy. Stiggy's too obvious. I'm gonna start with Brett Keen. Brett Keen's too obvious. J Dubs. Transparent. I'm gonna start where this starts. Happy Cabby. Maybe you can explain what is threatening or harassing about somebody defending themselves. You keep insisting there's no such thing as false flagging. You keep making yourself out a liar. Brett Keen managed to get himself kicked back off of YouTube again. For some reason, can't imagine what. You decided to use your influence to bring somebody that false flags, false DMCAs, harasses, lies, defrauds, plagiarizes. Shall I continue? Back onto YouTube. The man is a walking terms of service violation. His latest is not just to attack Ash. There are a lot of people that don't like Ash. He's attacking Ash's daughter. So I'd like for you to go through the video that got taken down that Ash posted defending himself. And I want you to make some apologetics explaining what was harassing about him defending himself against harassment. Ought to be easy. You haven't had any trouble making excuses for everything else that you've done. Uh, you haven't had any trouble making excuses for a flagging system that's obviously breaking. You even lied to defend it. So, Cabby, my question for you is if there's no such thing as false flagging, why was this video taken down? Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Brett Keen. I wanted to talk a little bit about Ash the Raven and how he's trying to rip some people off on YouTube. He claims that he needs $1,500 or he's going to lose his home and him and his daughter is going to be out on the street. Now if that were true, that would be a horrible story and I would want anybody in that situation to get help. But unfortunately, there's something that a lot of you must have missed. You see, Asta Ravens has already admitted repeatedly in older videos, including on his old Asta Raven Phoenix YouTube channel, that a while back his wife left him and took custody of their child. Which means that the child actually lives with the mother. You see, the thing here, here, here is here, Brad. This PM was ridiculous. <laughs> First of all, it jumped to a very wild conclusion. 
Yeah, you said that I'm sorry. I said that you were lonely. I had no idea that your wife left you and took the kids. Blah, 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 blah. Brett, I don't know what rock you've been living under lately, but I recently put up a video called My Life as a Single Mother. I've been a single parent for 14 years. I have had custody of my daughter since she was three months old. I left my wife because of a situation, a horrific situation, you couldn't even possibly imagine. Probably the worst thing that could happen to a child at three months old. Think about that. I've had custody of my daughter for, th for 14 years. But the situation I'm in now has nothing to do with that. I haven't been married in 14 years. And I haven't had any other kids in 14 years except my daughter. If you're going to be sympathetic to my plight, please be sympathetic to the right fucking plight. He, she may, the child may get the ability to visit him every now and then. But he's already lost a child a long time ago. So I'm curious why he's saying he's going to lose his child if he doesn't get $1,500. She's already got custody, legal as well as physical custody over the child. This here, I'm only going to give you the top bit, is... A court order from the High Courts of Justice, about the highest you can get in the United Kingdom. <laughs> now, here's the issue. Um, America takes child abduction very seriously. And in order for me to actually even go on a holiday in this country, I had to carry this sheet of paper around with me. Prove I got custody of. So the only thing I can think of is that he's using the kid in order to be able to get fifteen hundred dollars off of you guys. Now, if you guys want to be stupid enough to sit there and give this asshole money, who runs around and accuses everybody on YouTube of pedophilia, and clearly has some damn issues and stuff, then so be it. But I'm just letting you know that the guy is fucking playing you all out. Peace.